for our channel too. So start recording now. Oh. So I want to put the la, la, the Dash to Trade logo up. You know, well, I don't know. You yes. Can't, yes. You can't see it. But yeah. Uh, it doesn't matter. Yeah, that's the Perfect. idea. So how is everybody doing? We have two people in it right now. Uh, it usually takes a little bit. Uh, a little bit uh, to, fill to fill up. up. Yeah. 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 So, so I'm excited. We basically have only traders in front of us, right? Yeah, that's, that's right. Oh, only, man. only traders. Incredible. And super, super cool. Demo Street and, and they... T-Smonar are in the house. So how's everybody doing? So, yeah, we, we're going to start in about a minute. Uh-huh. We're going I guess then the, your audience is really clicking with the uh, with your picture, right? Success isn't uh, owned. You know that it's least. And I love that. Every single day, you know, nobody ever has ever asked me about that one. The only one that I get asked is about my my Lee Jeffries. But you know that's fine. Hi, how are you? I'm fine. So we're Rahim. Thank you. So why don't we start? Uh huh. Why don't we start? Uh, just a second before we start. And I introduce you to the man himself. I just want to check our sound. I just want to check our sound. My Lee Jeffries. But, you know, that's fine. Yep, our sound is good. Fine. There you go. I have mine too. I just told Orlando the story of going to Belgium yesterday to get a, to get a proper microphone for this show. Yeah, exactly. Perfect, no? So, how's good. everybody doing? Oh boy! Just a that second. Is... Now you are. Yeah, I'm upside down. <laughs> there you go. Oh Lord! You know, those it's the preparation are, those for the flight, right? Yeah. I'm frozen now. Yep. yep, you are. Now hold on just a second. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. All right. All right, so uh, I I'm just to... Oh, Orlando, you're still frozen, eh? Ah, now you're back. There you are. Yep. You had to work for that success, right? To make that yeah, exactly, work. exactly. <laughs> I just learned something new. Yeah, man. exactly. So about that, that is not my quote. That is a, uh, that's a quote from, uh, from this professional football player, but, you know, American football player. No. Mm -hmm. Yeah, American football. I should have shade for this. <laughs> you know, and, and uh, it always has clicked with me, you know, because it's true, you know, success is known, it's least, and it's bread is due every day, so you have to do everything. I mean, uh, you have to hustle every single day to make it happen. Same. Uh, you know, you have to cut ties with every anything at all that um, doesn't push you towards your goals. And I had to find out that the hard way when I was younger, but you know, it's fine See? now. So everybody, let me introduce you to Tim. Tim is our community manager at dash to trade How are you, Tim? I'm great, man. I'm looking forward to this call awesome. to talk to first time with traders. Yeah, I'm looking forward to that product too. And you know, um, that's a trader that uh, started back in the day when uh, nothing, nothing, I mean, uh, there was nothing really, really available. Uh, you know, education-wise, news-wise. And uh, I had to scramble all around the internet to find information. You know, having everything in one place is going to be awesome. So we are going now to discuss everything behind the dance to trade uh, token, the product itself, and what you guys can expect. Right, Tim? Yes, yes exactly. Excited about it, yes. So, so yeah. yeah, dash to trade. Um, yeah, first it's... of all, the name. The name is amazing. Dash to trade. It's a dashboard, right? Exactly. It's a dashboard. It's a platform. Uh, we call it. It's a platform uh, that uh, arrives from uh, the ideas of Web three a bit. You know, where uh, we are building. Um, based on some of the technology of blockchain, you know, then some of the community building that is very important for the product. The community itself is very important for our product um, because uh, with the platform, you have 
the people who are involved, the users, also become producers in the sense that some of the stronger participants will um, also give information on trades. There's a discussion going on in, in, in the channels, right? Exactly. And the dialogue is fostering education, is fostering better trades, is also, you know, uh, giving you signs when you have a weakness, support from the community. This is one aspect we are building. So very community based and um, well, we are plugging into the resources from learn to trade. Um, you have already built a successful community and on top of that, um, we are building the product. Yeah, the, the main difference between other community that we're trying to build on Dash to Trader uh, platform is that it's more interactive, right? Right now we do have a big community. I'm sorry, a big community, but um, it's very one sided in the sense that uh, uh, we have built a big community on the signal side, right? Uh, but uh, that on the signal side is really just one side. People getting our content. And now, well, the only interaction that we do have with uh, our community is our live shows on YouTube and my live uh, uh, Q and A on Instagram. That people seem to mm -hmm. really, 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 really dig. Now, uh, having an overall, you know, a daily, daily interaction with other traders is something necessary for your growth. And it's something that I found out earlier to, uh, in my career too. Uh, also because this job, it's not that it can be very lonely, it is very lonely, right? Uh, so you uh, having another set of eyes on what you do is necessary in my opinion because, be, because uh, this job is quite lonely you can get into mm -hmm. a tunnel vision, right? Where you you don't see your leaks uh, without someone else, uh, you know, spotting them for you. And that is if you don't have a proper, uh, you know, uh, process for finding leaks. And having a proper for a process for finding leaks is quite difficult because it takes a ton of discipline. But, um, you know, turning, <laughs> turning back to the community, uh, and uh, you told earlier that, uh, uh, you know, uh, the uh, trades are going to be both ways too. Can you explain that a little bit? Well, yeah, so the community is one aspect that we want to nurture over the next years. Um, then the product itself, the platform, is first web-based and the idea is um, different to the stock market um, with crypto, you have a lot of data, right, like on-chain data. And our key products are really um, centered at that. So. Um, we identified, you know, we have very experienced traders uh, that are in the crypto space for a long time. And those are separated into, let's say, three fields. One field is trading uh, macro, uh, uh, trading um, uh, big caps, like the top 100 crypto projects. Um, then one area is um, sniping and one area is presets. Um, so presets is basically the stage before an ICO, before a, a, before a project goes online on chain, a public on chain and the token is tradable. Before that, there is a, a, a sales stage where people can get in and, you know, have just often multiples. Um, yeah. Uh, a much a way way different it's like a mix of investing and trading i would say you know it's when you ask a conservative um, investor that worked at a hedge fund then you know they have a very different perspective on investment than what we would call investment these days working in crypto but we would say you look out in presets you look out for really strong quality projects that don't have any threat vectors like coming out with a code that is malicious you know bad tokenomics I think like that, where that, that is very important for for uh, for people listening to us because that information is clearly not available uh for free or maybe it is but it's really hard to find it right so uh... right exactly it takes a lot of work to find it that's what we identified you know what we see as our what what we can bring to the market yeah to what has been established already even though it's a very young industry you know it feels like oh my god it's like bitcoin is there for 10 years whatever you know that is that feels long but it's actually not right and um 
So the projects that have uh, been developed over the last couple of years that uh, focus on on-chain um, to make uh, on-chain readable, like Nansen and so forth, like Dex Screener, all those uh, competitors, they have all the very niche functions, you know. So what we identified is that we want to build an, a tool, a platform that is targeting traders, particularly traders, to make their life easier in different ways. Like one is to gather what is going on in the pre-sale space, like what projects are soon coming out, and to filter out all the threat vectors that come with those. Like if you do the research yourself in the market, you have to go to 10 different websites, go in on all this, all the different um, types of information, check the URL, check the Twitter, check, uh, you know, do they have following? Is it, is the following, is it real or is it fake? Is it bought? You know, all those kind of things. Through the, uh, you know, through the, even through the tools that tell you that if they have bought, uh, followers and comments and likes on there, because that is a red flag for a project, right? If uh, if their Please. social media Thank following uh, is bot and their social media interaction is bot, that that to me would be a red flag, right? And if you, don't, I mean, if you don't have that information in one place, uh, I'm I'm a, not a hundred percent. I I always say or hate to say a hundred percent, but ninety percent sure that nobody is going to go to that step. Uh, to uh, make sure that their following is, is actually real, right? Uh, and to me, that is a very, very good time. Remember that you can ask anything you want, uh, any question you want to ask Tim, just uh, type it on the chat. Mm -hmm. Uh, Orlando, uh, let me just jump into what you just said. Yeah, I have to unfortunately, unfortunately, red pill you here. Oh, boy, I boy, think boy, boy. Hey, you fine, know, fine. in the in terms of in terms of the the um, for example, nearly this is something I found out like a couple of months ago. This is only for crypto because you are in the in the stock market and uh, the companies will not buy one hundred thousand fake followers, right? In the crypto market, it's almost standard that each NFT project or a crypto like blockchain project is a, either it is like an ecosystem project um, or it is building on top of an ecosystem they all but most of them buy followers you know and you could even you could even argue if they are really serious let's say ocean protocol is like a a, a, a platform that is um that is uh building a decentralized data marketplace right they are so serious that they would never do that but it is a tiny fraction of the market you know most go with buying followers and so forth so it is you know our social sentiment analysis that we are offering um that uh, will go into the details of okay there is fake following yeah is is there follow through are there people who interact with it like is there a real community you know that is important stuff like are people actually interacting in the telegram groups this this goes over exactly exactly right discord telegram all those places yeah that's a, that's a good way to to know if uh, you know if the, if the project is uh, real or not i mean fake following i understand that uh, most projects are going to buy followings because it is very, very difficult to grow organically uh, a social media account. Only if it's not mm -hmm. TikTok, I think. <laughs> See. But uh, but uh, having real interaction within a Discord server cannot be faked. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. Unless you have some you some you, some friends at the FBI or the or you or you have super super coding skills that you create a bot that creates hundreds of thousands of Discord accounts. But you know that's unconceivable. Yeah. But you know, coming back to Dash or Trade, having that tiny bit of information available for every single project that is on the scanner. Just a click away mm -hmm. is amazing to me. To me, that is worth the entire thing, you know. And uh, not only that, we, we, you were talking about two different kind of uh, trading per day, right? The pre-sale and the mm -hmm. sniping. The pre-sale is, um, you know, like having access to uh, buying shares before an IPO, right? Sniping. Exactly. Sniping is finding projects that are already tradable in in the, the exchanges 
but are have not boomed or have not skyrocketed yes. or moved. Yes, you know, like everybody I... likes to say it. <laughs> exactly, man. Exactly. So can you Orlando. Talk a bit about that? Except, love that you know. I love that you go there because really, I'm excited about this. I'm first of all, I sniped myself for like two years. I was sitting in front of the prominent platforms and I waited for projects to list. Then you know, it was this game of as fast as possible scanning through the most important threat vectors. You go to you, the 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 project pops up. First of all, there are no alarms on those platforms now. Some of them one one integrated now telegram alarms cool you know but we want to bring this further but then um like what do people normally have always on them a phone right we need to work with that that we have alarms for the phone in the future you know because who wants to sit for 10 hours per day in front of the goddamn screen you know and and watch for new listings coming up with the eyes when we have the ears as an additional a way to get alarms to to recognize a moment of opportunity okay we have an alarm that we pre-filter and then we go behind the screen and we take an opportunity based on us doing the pre-work like you know checking code and so forth so the the um the sniping works like this you sit for anyone who is not yet familiar i bet we have some nerds there um so you sit in front of the screen, something new pops up that just released on the chain, and then you try to, as fast as possible, let's say this is $20,000 market cap, right? You try to, as fast as possible, identify if there are any threat vectors or if it's a great product. So you go to the Twitter place, you go to the URL, to the, to the website, you check the code. For that, there are now uh, separate uh, platforms already just for like, coin sniffer and so forth they do the code checking you know but you have to go through like six seven eight nine ten different steps depending on how much risk averse you are right so and then it also exactly and it comes down to time the more due diligence you do the less opportunity you have because other people are less risk averse you know and they will take the trade earlier so that's crazy mm -hmm. to me because the, I mean, the better you operate risk reward i mean uh, risk wise the less opportunity mm -hmm. you're going to have but now with the dash to trade platform everything is going to be in one single place so you're going to be able to snipe with a lower risk than those people that really uh, have uh, that are really 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 not risk that are really risk averse right and uh, yeah uh, that's one of the things that has kept me out of that space, you know, um, uh, trying because there's hundreds of new projects coming out every single day, right? But uh, most of them are just bumps and dumps, right? Uh, rock pools, etc. But finding finding the good ones uh, just takes a ton of time. And to be completely honest, yeah, uh, because my main focus is currencies. And uh, futures, I don't have the time to do that due diligence. But now, with the Dash to Trade platform, I can integrate sniping, uh, you know, crypto into my own trading. And that is something yeah. I'm looking forward. Let's see if we have any questions from the audience. I have a full video of the Dash to Trade benefit. Give me a video link. Uh uh, Orlando, I would love to. I, I let's remember this one. I would love to just go into the third section of it because yeah. we have also we have uh, big traders behind us, you know, that are that are building with us together, and we we have quants and we have traders that know the crypto market really really well, and you know the third area like the pre say the sniping and the third area is giving signals to to big caps right and. Um, we rely there on the input of our traders that will give the signals so that traditionally, if someone wants to trade those and is not interested in pre-sales, in faster rewards, you know, the third section is the faster reward. You have to have patience, yes, but it's not that with the pre sale sometimes you have to wait weeks or months. It, some of us want the reward immediately, you know, and that will always drive a percentage of traders towards taking a trade today and, you know, saying, okay, 
I weigh two more trades than I go into presets, you know? <laughs> so, because the duration of waiting is just, you know, particularly with our short attention span with, uh, with social media and so forth, we want to do everything right now. So, we want to cater those people too, and we do believe there is, you know, there is a good reason for that, because the market will grow exponentially the next couple of years, unless there's a big war. We might have some setbacks, but, you know, to cater those people that want to take trades, on big caps like the top 100 sometimes there's maybe an outlier we want to catch in the 140 you know these people will, will also cater but very specifically we recognize that there is a big need for people who are in, not interested in education and then a small percentage that is interested in learning all the things we want to cater those two groups and give signals for people to entry and exit and then the other group to build a proper foundation for education but not only the education of technicals also a bit about you know the psychology like use like yeah, your picture in the background is telling right that is psychology you have to work every day you have to be patient you know exactly and success will come so you have to be disciplined and you have to hustle and the, it's a great yeah. thing that you're talking about that because yes i understand that people i mean uh, some people just want to day trade they don't care about uh you mm -hmm. know uh, icos they don't care about uh, you know well uh, sniping they want to day trade bitcoin they want to day trade ethereum they want to trade mm -hmm. day trade litecoin or whatever right um yes and uh, catering those uh people also is something that uh, to me brings the circle around because we're catering basically uh the entire all of the needs of needs of the entire crypto community here so that is amazing mm -hmm. and having everything in one single place also is it's uh, wonderful because if uh, there i mean i'm sure that there are going to be people that want just the same also they're going to start looking at the success rates on sniping on our snipes or on our you know pre-sale pre mm -hmm. so they're mm -hmm. going to add that to their trading arsenal and uh, they're going to start building a, a much much stronger portfolio right all within the yeah. dash to trade platform so that is something that i am just looking forward because i'm going to be one of those people like i told you before i don't snipe and uh, I am looking forward to add that to my trading arsenal, mate. Mm, so that's beautiful. Uh, we, so, and you know, we, we as a team, we always say it's delayed gratification. You know, the preset, for example, is the most delayed gratification. That, in, my, in our opinion, we discuss this a lot, like with Scott and Duco. Um, um, we were discussing that you know, that might be main reason why people are less focusing on this space, even though it has the highest returns. But it is with everything else in life, right? We want to have the like on the social media. We, we don't like to run every day for 20 kilometers, even though the delayed gratification will build us stronger, make us more successful with money, women, you know, like everything in our life. We go rather with the, you know, with the French fries and the curry <laughs> to, to have the immediate like, I understand. We are, I mean, we are not focused on, on, on future. Maybe we are focused on the future, but what we don't like is just uh, uh, we lack the discipline of uh, mm -hmm. waiting for the results for coming. Mm -hmm. And uh, you know what? That's also one of the things that uh, we might plug here. Which is the dash to trade token that is on pre-sale now. <laughs> that so, I believe myself, like I told you before, it is going to. Uh, I mean, it is going to get hit, get hit by a ton of buying volume because of how good this platform is going to be and how much uh, people in the crypto space are going to be adding up to their portfolio this token to get involved with our platform. So yes, everything is looking great. We don't have any questions here, but you know what? Uh, why don't we do this? I would love to have you. I do a live show every single day. So I would love to have you at least once a week um, so we can discuss and uh, introduce you to more people because right now we didn't get as much as, uh, as a view. 
that I want, but uh, I need for I need for everybody to know uh, what we're building. So why don't you? Why don't we do that? You know, spontaneously, I am going to bring Tim to my live shows, um, so you can ask him anything at all about how long it will take because I wonder that too until we get that platform. Perfect. All right. Uh, so. Um, Thank you everybody for joining us and uh, yeah, I'm going to put this video on the channel so you can review it. Mm. And anything you want to add, Tim? No, no man, we're, we're grateful to build a community with people who are really interested in uh, making money with us. That is the foundation for a healthy life, right? And particularly in the, in the economic times that we are living right now, where everything is uh, built around uncertainty, we need to find ways to bring more certainty back into our individual lives to support the family and so forth. And to, you know, there is a, there is a book, The Network State, it's called, uh, a very influential book right now, Vitalik Buterin and so forth wrote about it, uh, medium articles. Um, it goes into the concepts of shared, um, like shared vision uh, and like religion brings together people based on um, shared ideas, right? And traders, traders have these, these strongest shared ideas, like and goals. We, you know, it's about building a future together. And that is a great foundation to, to build a product up on and, you know, uh, uh, build a community up on where we all work together on individually getting more successful and nurturing each other, you know, and the technology behind it should back that so that there is no friction involved that we make like the Apple iPhone, right? It was created so that we can communicate without friction and they probably succeeded. The same we want to do with trading. We want to build solutions that, you know, bring frictionless um, information to the user and then have have also dialogue in our community uh, environments that we build, like first on Discord and maybe in some other ways. So thank you, Orlando, for hosting, and I'm looking forward to the next one, man. Cheers. Thank you, Tim. Have a great day. And remember, guys, uh, Tim is our community and marketing manager at Dash to Trade. Um, anything you want to ask him, just leave a comment, and uh, he will be back. Uh, he will be back later this week, whenever uh, I don't know when. Um, you know, uh, but I usually go live around this time because in 30 minutes is the New York Open. So uh, today was a perfect <laughs> time, you know, uh, one hour of chit chat and then we go live for for the New York Open. So, uh, yeah, why don't we do this later this week, mate? Love, love it. Love it. Sounds good. Love Orlando. Me. Cheers. A successful day. Thank you. Cheers, man. <laughs> Gracias. Bye. Bye. All right, guys, so uh, we are going to go uh, live uh, right now. Yeah, I'll use the same stream. So hold on. Uh -huh, trading view. All right. Uh, I am going live right now, guys. Uh, you know, I'm sorry.